for me restart will be showing you how to update your samsung galaxy s3 to official android 4.2.2 so what you're going to do, first of all is what you're going to do is go onto your phone and check that your you have got the same model number as me by going to about device and you have got the same information showed there and if not then you cannot do this update just one little leg off me or samsung i'm responsible for any damages you do to your phone you do this at your own risk so let's carry on with the video so once you have got all the right stuff for your phone what you're going to do is put your phone into the debugging mode by going to developer options and clicking usb debugging make sure you basically you've got a tick there and then you are all good to go then what you're going to do is you're going to power your device off and then once your device is powered off what you're going to do is put it into download mode uh, holding the off button the home button and the down button down uh, volume down key all together and as you can see it comes up with a custom OS can cause critical problems in phone and installed applications if you want to download a custom OS press volume up key otherwise press the volume down key to cancel so all you're going to do is press the volume up key and now it is over to the computer okay guys so now you're over on the computer is what you're going to do is in this video description you'll find two links to these two uh, zips and all you're going to do is extract this zip the whole of it so I'm going to extract these all to my desktop and I think that is done yep and then what you're going to do is click on the other and you will see in that one it's got a .tar.md5 and just extract that to your desktop also Okay, so both of them are extracted, so what I'm going to do is just open up Audion. And as you can see, it's detected my phone. If it does not detect your phone, uh, then try installing the drivers for your phone again, or try restarting your computer, or unplug the USB and try plugging it back in again. So all I'm going to do is go to PDA, and then look for the folder I extracted. So there it is. Click open, and click start and now as you can see Audion is doing uh, installing it into the phone
as you can see now, my phone is restarting. And as you can see now, it is upgrading my Android software to Android 2.2.2. So it is safe now to close Odeon. Oh, I've just done that, as you can see. And now it's mainly back over on the phone. So yeah guys, thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed the video, uh, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe button, and don't forget to comment if you have any problems, I will try to answer you all, so yeah guys, thanks.